Hello there nieces and nephews, this is Travels by Auntie Jenny. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to have some fine dining here at the Kitchen Restaurant in Sacramento, California. At this restaurant, it's an open kitchen setting where they highly recommend that you get up and go around and mingle and talk with all the chefs and staff. And back here in the kitchen, they have lots of different snacks and hors d'oeuvres for you to snack on before dinner starts. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? You know what you're eating? Oh, I know. Okay, this is filet mignon tartare. Mm -hmm. So there's a little bit of pickled mustard seed on top. There's a little bit of uh, apples in there, a little bit of cornichons, a little bit of um, uh, capers on a poppy seed cracker. And these are imported Casa Vitrano olives imported from Italy. Ooh. Yeah, flown all the way from the motherland. And then there's uh, some vegan spring rolls in back yeah. if you want. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Welcome in. You've been here before? No, it's no, the first welcome. Time. Yeah, go for it. Those are delicious. These are vegan spring rolls. There's a uh, pickled ginger, pickled bean sprout, a uh, fresh carrot and cucumber. Uh, mint cilantro, a little bit of passion fruit, and a, a candy kumquat on top. They are delicious. Wow. Uh, it's very good chip. You? It is Don't a you? you can look. Yes, these are not ready yet. Don't okay. worry. We just wanna... She's filming. Okay. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hey, you guys are going to get these later during intermission. Well, these are yeah, you'll get one of these later for your mini-bees. So, it's your second tarragon. course of dinner. They look yummy. Hey, thank you. <laughs> it looks like matcha. Uh, I'm Italian. I'm Italian. I'm Italian. Mm -hmm. Once I started eating, I'm like, hey, Never. Are we celebrating anything special? Just girls' night out. I love that. I love that. <laughs> How many are in your party? Just us two. Just us two. Are we at the counter? Yes. Yeah. Good seating. Are you in the front, the middle, the back? Right in the middle. Right smack in the middle. You see all the action. We've been planning this for months, and we're finally here. We're finally here. It's like your night memorable. Thank you. Thank you so much. These are our take on like sour cream and onion. Um, yeah, there's a there's a house dry house dry tarragon, house dry dill, jalapeno. It's now time to head on back to our table to really enjoy these snacks. Samples that they give while you wait, and you go and tour the kitchen. Now we're ready to eat now. <laughs> what do you think so far? It's different. Looking forward to seeing how it tastes. Cheers. Okay, it's my first time ever having tartar. Scared. There's Tartar. Are you scared, friend? Hey. There goes nothing. Very good. Yeah? How about an olive first? Stop being scared. This is the olive from from the homeland, Italy. Mm. That's good. Mm -hmm. I'm very scared to eat this. Robbie, when I said I would never eat it. It's always the first time for everything. Can I half it? No, you have to stick the whole thing in your mouth. Uh, I'm scared. One, two, three, go. Four, five. Can you eat it, friend? Please? Just try it. Can I have it? You need the cracker, though. There's a texture. Wow. 
That was one quarter of his head. We like yeah, What do you exactly. think? It's we good, right? Lively, but it was good for them. Honest, honest, but then it's true. It's good, but you can taste that it's raw meat. Yeah, for sure. But it's good. It's good, though. Now, before anything is even served, staff will come around and actually ask you whether or not you want to purchase wine pairings with your food, cocktails, or even mocktails. I myself chose the mocktail pairings. I was like, you know, why not? Here at the Kitchen Restaurant is actually a prefix meal of six courses with an intermission. Food will be served pretty soon, so sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. Sonoma Coast and Mendocino, and we are celebrating those. So the first thing that you guys have 
was a little pot de creme of porcini mushroom coming from Mendocino, and then we finished that off with a little bit of wild radish, all right? And then coming around to everybody, the first course is gonna be a savory cannoli. And since we don't really have much peas right now, we've decided to make a custard with pea tendrils, all right? And then we are gonna serve that with some yellow foot mushrooms coming from the Sonoma coast. And we are gonna finish the whole thing off with a fondue a uh, beautiful burrata and mozzarella. Now this is a local buffalo milk mozzarella, you guys, and burrata. And we are getting this, believe it or not, there are two producers of uh, buffalo milk uh, mozzarella cheese in California. One of them is located in Western Marin County. And if you didn't know, show some local pride kids, one of them is located about 10 minutes south of here in the lovely little hamlet of Wilton, California. All right? Woo! I know. There we have the entire population of Wilton here with us tonight, everybody. <laughs> all right, so, uh, but anyway, we're going to make an incredible creamy fondue and place all of that on top. Then the next one, you guys, we are celebrating one of the harbingers of spring, at least in my mind. I am a Northern California kid. So we are celebrating Monterey uh, Peninsula artichokes, all right? And what we're going to serve with that is this amazing uh, green garlic spetzele and then a beautiful braised daikon. What we're actually doing with that is we're going to braise it down in a rich vegetable stock and then we're almost treating them like scallops. So we're going to sear them on one side and butter baste them and then finish the whole thing off with some uh, fried artichokes on top, all right? Now, kids, we used to do this thing that was called intermission, right? And then, of course, the coronavirus came along, and we had to stop doing fun things for a while, right? And then, oh, and then Gavin came along, right? And closed all of the restaurants, oh, oh, yes, it, well, except for the ones he wanted to go to, right? <laughs> <laughs> to your table, all right? Uh, so you don't have to push old people out of the way or anything like that, all right? So, uh, but I would encourage you guys, get up and walk around, see what we're doing. Go talk with the cooks in the back. Uh, I literally have 200 gallons of liquid nitrogen back there. I don't know, go freeze things. Doesn't matter to us, all right? <laughs> then when we come back, you guys, we have an amazing pasta filled with some local stinging nettles. And we are serving that with one of my very favorite things on the planet, you guys. We have some Dutch white asparagus, actually poached in white truffle butter, all right? And then we are finishing that whole dish off with some wild mustard and a little bit of black trumpet mushrooms coming from the Mendocino coast. Then last but not least, you guys, I work with Sunfed Ranch. I don't know if you know about these guys. I really dig their program. They're over in uh, Woodland, California, all right? And they are 100 percent yeah, one person from Woodland now, too. Yeah. Three from Wilton, one from Woodland. We're working good, all right? so. Uh, they're great, you guys. They're like 100% grass-fed, but they're also practicing regenerative agriculture, which I really dig. Uh, but we are taking their amazing beef cheeks and we are braising them down with white wine and aromatics, serving out with a wild rice hanji and a pump on dock. And you're probably like, what the hell is that? It's one part potato and four parts butter. <laughs> there you go. All right, then we also have an amazing cheese board, you guys. Save room for that. We have a dessert of wild uh, cherry blossom custard with uh, wild uh, huckleberries and blueberries in this amazing tart. And then last but not least, you guys, I have a little tray of sweets for you tonight. Uh, it's called Mignardise, all right? And if you didn't know, that's a French word for, I don't know, diabetes, probably. I'm not going to say that's going to But kids, the most important thing is that it is Friday night. You got the whole weekend ahead of you. Let's have a good time.
Alfredo sauce. <laughs> Cream sauce. Yeah. Oysters up here, and you have an allergy to fin fish, I believe, right? It's not that. I just, I just don't eat clams. Or oh, oysters. Fish. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sweet. All right. Um. So, first of all, you have a nice um soy and uh, coconut milk and brown sugar uh, glazed maitake mushroom. Okay. So that's served with a little bit of leek katsu right there. Okay. And then you have um some nice potato chili and um uh, cheese, Oaxacan cheese empanadas oh. with a little bit of poblano crema. Okay. Yeah. 
So you have these cake oysters that you had in back with me earlier. Mm -hmm. This right here is going to be um, our hogwash, our version of mignonette. It's going to be lime juice, rice vinegar, shallow jalapeno, and cilantro. Mm -hmm. And then this bowl right here is going to be the rockfish ceviche, a little bit of sea buckthorn, a little bit of local Montez carrots with some Calabrian chili notes in there. And then you have a mahi pokey with some sumamoto cucumbers, a little bit of uh, uh, shisho and cucumber fluid gel, and a little bit of whiskey barrel aged soy sauce. Thank you. Yes, you're welcome. Thank you. I like how you talk. So it's like... Thank you. Hey. Ladies, how we doing?
recommend finishing your meal with a plate of cheese and enjoy your dessert. Thank you. Thank you.